Hello boys, Vic again here with another reaction. This time is a request or a suggestion I must say, um, Yu-Gi-Oh! endings, all endings. I'm gonna do all endings guys, uh, because I've done the openings and I had some issue with the openings. I couldn't finish them unfortunately. I mean, I did finish them. I couldn't post them on YouTube for use. But look, we are doing the endings now and I actually got YouTube premium today just so i can do this reaction just so i don't have to download all the links before you know and get rid of the ads make it enjoyable for you as also and uh, yeah i got a one month free and we will see probably i will cancel it after but i i got it just for this video so i can um, so i can do this video because last time the editing took me ages you know download every link post it I mean, edit it, you know, compile everything together and then look at it. So, yeah, it was a bit of a hassle. So now we are doing it straight away from YouTube and see how it goes, you know. And like this, I can even see the op uh, see the endings, uh, the name, the titles and everything. So, yeah, before, uh, before we get into the video, guys, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. If you like the content, if you're looking forward for these kind of reactions, let me know. I am doing requests, so don't hesitate to drop them down in the comments, uh, especially if you have openings and endings from animes that I've seen or I haven't seen actually. Um, don't hesitate to recommend them, yeah? Okay, let's go. First one, Yu-Gi-Oh! Season 0 ending. Ashita Mori, Ashita Moshi Kimi ga koare tomo. Koare. Let's go. I think this is the very first one, and correct me if I'm wrong. I actually know this one. I mean, I know. I remember the song. I don't remember the ending. Visuals. This is really nostalgic. Like I said, I used to watch Yu-Gi-Oh ages ago, and it was with this in this time frame, the the OG Yu-Gi-Oh. Like you know, can't say I remember that much about the plot and anything, but. I remember there was some badass moments. If you have any badass moments like, uh, you know, fights, du duels, drop them down in the comments. I, I'm, I'd be happy to, to watch them, like a top 10 fight or top, you know, like a cool scene, you know, like a boss fight or anything. Let me know. It doesn't even have to be from Yu-Gi-Oh. could be from any kind of anime, guys. Because to be honest, I don't know what, what to look for. I love these Egyptian hieroglyphs. They look so sick. The eye of Horus. Oh my god. Everything looks so nice. Season 1 energizing shower. I move so fast. Aki Maeda is the name of the woman. I like her voice. It's really soothing like. I hope you guys can hear, uh, I'm not gonna play them too loud, last time when I done the Gintama endings I got away with it, I had just two copy copyrights, I didn't have to edit the video that much, so I'm gonna keep the volume at 30, I think it works for me, the content ID doesn't pick up um, the songs. I think I also remember this song. Huh. Man. I like it. <laughs> it looks so innocent. The afternoon of that day, it's called Masami Okui. Season 2 That's a nice song Kinda like gives you um, Last year of high school uh, vibes, you know This reminds me of Get Backers, by the way 
Yeah, and also let me know, uh, guys, are you a 90s kid? Uh, what other anime did you watch? Uh, don't hesitate to, to let me know. I would love to talk about old anime, which is, you know, like, that's kind of my slice of pie. I do watch new anime, of course, but, you know, animes like One Out, uh, Monster, um, Mushishi, Yu-Gi-Oh, Slam Dunk, Inuyasha, um, so many others, so many others, guys. Sorry, I was just looking at. Mm -hmm. Yeah, must have been uncomfortable to wear that chain around your neck every day, man. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, <laughs> for a kid, you know, like oh. imagine wearing that in real life. You know, that's like what, ten kg of pure gold. I wouldn't mind wearing it. <laughs> I like the endings so far, they're nice. Bro, you're in the desert with that on your neck. I, you know. Guys, let me know, are you from a warm climate? Have you ever been at the beach, let's say you have a chain on your neck and you go at the beach like, you know, and you sleep on the beach and then when you, when you, you know, you're fried, but then when you move from there, you like that chain is like, oh, so hot on your neck, like that's, you know, that feeling. Nice. I like this song, it's cool. <laughs> I might give it a go, man, you know, to Yu-Gi-Oh. I'm not gonna make any promises because we have a different project now going on, uh, but... I wanna start back on Gintama and... Um, there's room for another uh, series, but we are thinking to do Demon Slayer, you know, but we will see. We will see. I would definitely like to watch the first few seasons of Yu-Gi-Oh on my own, like, you know, the first four, four five seasons, the, the OG seasons. I'm not gonna judge, I'm not gonna say the newer ones are uh, worse, uh, but these ones, they look just better for me, you know, I don't know what it is, maybe it's the graphic, maybe because it's that, uh, they bring, bring me back to that period. I don't know, I really like the way they used to do anime in the 90s. It was just different, you know, different. And I also think anime was a bit more, like, serious at the time, you know, like, I'm not saying now it's no, because if you watch, but even shonen series back then, they were, they were a bit more, you know, down to earth, like, you know, a bit more re realistic, like, you know. Now I think they're more like too colorful, let's just say, if you know what I mean. I think you'd, uh, they used to do a better job back then depicting um, the realities, you know, even in an anime, like even in an anime, I think that's of course unrealistic. You could say the uh, relationship between the characters were was more natural i don't know now it feels like it, it feels different you know anime i don't know what if that's the decisive factor but i think anime before it felt different oh look at us that's nice mm. cool huh all of them have like an egyptian team Sick. Man, these would make great tattoos, you know what I mean? I really like the designs, they're epic. And this looks like fun to watch, looks like it's it's nice to watch. Hmm. He reverted back to his normal form, he reverted into the other thing, the other armor.
They have a really good art style. I mean, the anime is really good. It's drawn really nice, you know, it's pleasant to watch, like... Yu-Gi-Oh! was not really my thing. In that time, uh, I used to watch, I've seen it, but I used to watch um, Dragon Ball. Dragon Ball was kind of like my thing at the time, you know? That was my main anime, let's just say. Same way One Piece now is my main anime. What you guys think about Dragon Ball? The super, I haven't seen Super, you know, I, I feel like everything should have finished with, with Z, like, you know. And it's just like they can't reproduce that. I think the graphics in Z, which is like fucking 20 years ago, looks better than... No, I don't remember these characters. It's better than the ones that... Jesus, he's so ugly. Probably he's obno ob obnoxious, like... He's the villain. The art style is still the same a bit. You can see, you can see this is straight away after. What's the name of this? Borderline by Jam Project. Yu-Gi-Oh! GX Japanese. Okay, GX. Oh yeah, by the way guys, I'm super happy that the endings are you know they are in Japanese. I I that's I prefer them like this, you know. I don't like the dubbed versions. I prefer the Japanese versions. I have nothing against the dubbed versions. Don't get me wrong. Like Dragon Ball, I seen dubbed. You know, if it comes on TV like that when you're a kid, you watch what they give you, and you get, and then you're like, "Oh, dubbed is the best." But then it's like you find other series that you prefer subbed. So you, so, you know what I mean. There's not one better than the other, it's just a matter of personal opinion. For me, I prefer the subs. Some dub. I mean only Dragon Ball. I kind of like start to uh, link them up. I mean, I do understand now, you know, because I seen the openings, I kind of like start to understand a bit the, the time frame. Also, by the way, thanks for commenting with the time frame. I didn't get back to you. I hope you're going to watch this video. I will answer. Uh, thanks very much for for laying down uh, uh, the, the time frame and um, the info about uh, I have to get back to your comment also. Hmm. This reminds me of Digimon, to be honest. That little, th uh, little monster flying uh, beside him. Mm. As the proper deck. Huh. Don't remember how the the you know how that uh, I don't know how it's called guys. Sorry for being ignorant. You know the thing that they had on the hand that they have they pull the cards from. Uh, how was that working? Like who wow, who was shuffling? Like you know just like it was like a me mechanical. Or would you put your cards into it the way you want it and then when you battle you draw the cards or it was more like a, ah, I draw the cards and whatever comes in I have to use that card. I don't remember. Let me know. I wanna know. Hmm. I also like this. From the opening um, this didn't attract me that much but now when I watch the ending It feels cool. So this was Yu-Gi-Oh! GX.
cool. I really like the colors, by the way. Let's see if we can. This is the max quality that I can use. Yu-Gi-Oh! 5Ds ending. Yeah, this looks like it's a bit more. You can see it's newer, like. But to be honest, I prefer the art style and the, the designs of the old one, the very first one. Don't know, man. This just. It's not because it's nostalgic. It felt more detailed, you know? Like, I might be crazy, you know? But, like, if I seen scenes from Dragon Ball Super on the internet, and I'm like, this is terrible. This is looking terrible. Dragon Ball Z was looking better. Like genuinely, it's not necessarily about the way it's drawn, it's just, I mean, it's about that, the details is in the drawings, but I mean, even, you know, even the OSTs back then, they were like, ah, maybe this is just my nostalgic side taking over, you know? But you tell me if I'm wrong, if you've seen Dragon Ball Super and Dragon Ball Z, which one do you think is look looking better? Five D's ending to Okay, so I've just seen five cards. The five D's are they are they connected with that? The five dragons or something? Oh yeah, it looks like it. <laughs> My cat is going crazy. Trying to get into the kitchen. My wife's cooking something and he, uh, he's trying to get into the kitchen. He jumps on the door, guys. It's crazy. He he learned how to open the doors in the house, and now you're not safe in your fucking bedroom, like you know. I have to say the songs are really nice. So far, I I enjoy the songs. Nothing bored me, like nothing, it wasn't like a bad song, you know, all of them were nice. <laughs> they're the five Ds, I think, yeah? Them two uh, kids, the, they're twins or something, and then the three of them. Are they five of them, yeah? Hmm. What's the main guy uh, name, by the way? Do you like him as a character? And which one's your favorite, by the way? From all the the chronology, the timelines, the time frames, which 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 main guy is your guy? Oh, there were six of them actually. No. What's five D com comes comes from? Uh, let me know. Mm, the design of that dragon was sick. Looking like an angel or something. It's really nice. I really like the the designs, guys. The designs are pff, are legendary. I know people who have tattoos with Yu-Gi-Oh. You know, some of them dragons. Mm -mm -mm. They're looking sexy, man. I really like them. And they're just so different, you know. I'm always blown away by how, you know, the imagination of these mangakas, man, is... Hmm. Look at that. The clothing and everything, it's like solid, you know, like... I really like the designs and everything, they're cool, man. And the song was nice. Close to you. It doesn't say who's singing in it anymore. Sorry, I almost uh, flipped my mic. <laughs> Look at this. 
song is nice already I hope you guys can hear the 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 track is uh, really nice Last time I done it, I told you they destroyed me completely. Like, I have to find a different, uh, different uh, hobby. <laughs> not a different hobby, but I want to cover a few more um, openings and endings. And after that, I'm gonna I'm gonna stop with them for a while because the guys takes just so much to edit them <laughs> because of the content ID. Like, the algorithm picks up so many. When I done Gintama last time, I picked up picked up nine, which like five of them were like not impacting the channel in any way. Four of them had restrictions, and they were like restrictions all over the world, like you know. So I had to trim, cut. Uh, it takes ages, and then you have to upload again, export with the software that you edit, and. Man, the song is nice. <laughs> There's 38 of them, I think. Who's singing this? So that's Yu Gi Oh's 5Ds and 5 Plastic Tree Future Colors. <coughs> nice. That's long hair. I wonder how much her hair stylist charges her. Zexal Japanese My Quest by Golden Bomber Is this the ending? Oh yeah Yes Sick Man, I would love to be at a concert with this kind of music, you know what I mean? I really like it. And I'm not, I'm not a rock and roll type of, you know, I don't listen that much to rock, but it sounds so nice, man. We plan on going to Japan next year, and um, we would like to. I would like to visit the concert, see a concert with this kind of music, J Rock. Like, <coughs> nice. I mean, listen to those drums, man. Long in Frisia by Daisy Stripper. Zexal, uh huh? <laughs> the designs are so wacky. That guy's design is cool. The other guys are so like loony, so wacky. Hmm. 
This guy looks sick. He's the bad guy, probably. They're way younger. They're, they're even younger than... Than the ones from... Um, from the first one. <coughs> It's not the thing I, I like in anime, I like when in, in the anime the character grows with you, you know, if it's a long running series I would like the character to grow with you, the same way Goku grown, you know, from a teenager he got married, he had kids, he, you know, like, you know what I mean, like One Piece is like, I love One Piece but they're terrible at this, you know, <laughs> you know, it's been like what, 4 years, 5 years, in 25 years, in real life, like, you know what I mean. <laughs> it's crazy. Like, they're still teenagers, and I'm like, I'm a, I'm in my like mid thirties. Like, you know what I mean? <laughs> this looks fun. This looks fun. What's this about? Like, how do they battle here? Same way with the cards? Yeah, I mean, yeah, of course. But do they have a different system? Like, what's the what's so different what's majorly di different between them series like i'm actually curious you know i am really curious to know um how the na the the author connects them you know and i mean why i i wonder why he don't you know instead of following along you know with the same protagonist and um you know continuing with him I wonder why he's uh, switched is it the same guy not that uh, it's something bad with that I've one of my uh, favorite series is called Shura no Toki or the age of carnage and it's it's short it's like 26 30 episodes I think and they have the same thing they show you three characters from different three different timelines and it's beautifully done so i'm sure this is also beautifully done in that uh, regard i'm just uh, curious to know why he done that uh was it because of the popularity or it just was an artistic idea to, to do it huh <laughs> that design is sick who's that guy He's a... Nice. And th I'm pretty sure this is way more complicated than I think, you know. Um, I'm not talking about the complexity of the game, but I'm talking about the complexity of the series, you know what I mean? You know, uh, series who have a tendency of looking childish and... Uh, um, colorful and stuff like that they are usually more complex than than you than you give them credit when you see them at first time you know you wouldn't think what well, I'm I, I learned my lesson like I've seen hundreds of series of anime and I don't judge uh, a book by its cover you know that design was nuts hmm oh yeah Go away, go away by force, Tom. Hmm. Song is nice, graphic is nice. Mm -hmm. I like it. <laughs> Those are nice transitions. Oh, that guy was looking nice, the guy, the black dude, the monster, whatever it was. <laughs> Sick. Oh, his design was really nice. Hmm. 
I guess for people that are really nostalgic uh, watching these, you know, thanks for watching with, uh, with me guys, by the way, and also, uh, comment down below your age, I'm really curious uh, what kind of age range my subscribers are, you know. How is that a dog? Like a dogman or something. <coughs> Excuse me guys. You know what I mean? The, the openings were all over the place. I kind of like understand what's going on, you know, bits. And I really like uh, this is drawn really good like you know like I think it's drawn really good and I think it's getting in a way it's a mix between the last series that I seen and I was also uh, leaning towards the the original series I think you know the art style because they are drawn really different I think the art styles are different, but this one leans a bit more towards the first one. Oh man, look at that design. That design is sick. Oh, that design is sick also. They look so good, the designs. Especially in this one. I, I Overall, I think this is my favorite, uh, except the first one. This has really crazy, crazy designs. Like, I'm gonna talk a lot about designs, art style, uh, graphics, guys, because I don't know the, the, the you know the story that well. So okay, same ending three arc of smile. Oh, we're gonna play something, blackjack. By the way, some uh, some endings are uh, you can hear them harder. They're dropping down in volume. <laughs> they look like they're having fun. This makes me watch watch the series, you know. Oh, they're out in space also. Well, I wonder what kind of gang did they have? Like, what, what, what were they doing? What were their jobs like? You know. <laughs> that guy looks so pissed there in the corner on the right side. Was no there for speaking. Let's see where we are right now. Anyway, it doesn't matter.
I wanna get just just give me a second, boys. I just wanna. Yeah. Just wanna. Yeah, I wanted to to swap it on cinematic mode. That's his crush in the series. Oh, he was bold, huh? That's a nice intro. Hmm. <laughs> That's their gang, is it? I like this song also. Sounds really nice. Who's, in, who's singing the song again? Oh, it doesn't say. The title is in Japanese. Oh, it's nice. I love music, man. There's just so much emotion in music. You can feel that he's singing with, with passion, like, you know? The designs are so crazy! Look at that! Mm, man, this looks so nice. Hmm. Running into the sunset. Oh, the titles are only in Japanese right now. I can't. I, I wanted to know the artists. I have to check later in the description box for the song uh, before. That was a really nice one. TV Tokyo. <laughs> That's so fun. Ah, cool. So this is Arc 5. I mean 6. Hmm. Cool. I like the first and the second designs more than the rest. Really nice. The first guy is the main guy, yeah? He's nice. I like his design. The pants, hair, everything. The goggles on, on his... Sorry, my, my eyes. My eye started. Uh, 
pendulum so this is arc 5 boy so again different Jesus this, they're so confusing there are just so many of them so many timelines ah no it's the same what am I saying I'm so confused now it looks like it's from them and him they're from different all right so it's kind of like a mix it's like they've done arc and v range comparison ah okay okay so that was a comparison between them all right which ones i prefer the one on the left i think the one on the left looks nicer the song is nice it's really nice okay short cover is this in the same is this in the playlist yeah let's let me check because i didn't yeah this is in the playlist we're gonna skip this brains again what number is this this is number 32 we have six more Let's go. <laughs> he looks pissed, he looks angry. What are the... Oh... What? That was him? Look at his earrings, his earrings... I'm so confused right now, I don't know. Are these... Are those the, their avatars or something? Or what's the story? I was about to say this looks like it's drawn by the same guy, but probably is in it. <laughs> that guy looks like he just escaped from that from the second season of the first part that I've seen. You know the guy with the Egyptian uh, designs. There's so many characters. I wonder how long did it air from what year to what year i have to check i'm i'm really curious because this looks like it ended up you know like not that long ago you know what i mean a few years ago the last series maybe what 10 was this Yu-Gi-Oh sevens I'm gonna let this play in guys <laughs> Chronologically is this Huh Sevens. I think this is the last series, isn't it? No, no, no. It's a cool song. Like it's a song that you could listen uh, waking up, you know what I mean? It pumps you up a bit. Boom. Nice one, nice one. Seven special. That's more like it. Oh man, that guitar. Cool, cool, cool. I like this. <laughs> I 
talking about the concert I would like to go to see like I said huh, a concert like that man this looks really nice you can you can definitely see this in your like the monsters look sick oh. Huh. Cool. Episode eighty-seven. Yeah. So that's like episode eighty-seven from sevens or overall? No, has to be from sevens. What am I saying? Because there's like only five seasons from the first part, and then there's like I seen like thirty-eight only openings. Are you read ready? Special ending. Okay. Episode is by Romin Kirishima. I want to see the full, full description. By Romin Kirishima, see the Tomori Kusun Kusunoki. And this is actually from uh, from a Japanese channel. Man, who whoever done this, whoever done this. Uh, Compilation, you're a you're a legend, man. You're a fucking legend. This takes ages and dedication. Like you really have to be a fan to make this, you know. Also, if there's any Japanese people looking, uh, comment down below and let me know how big Yu-Gi-Oh is in Japan still up to this day. You know, um, I don't care about like ratings and stats. I just you know if you're a Japanese person how is it that like you know do you still talk with your friends about it or um, you know people that you uh, used, you know used to grow up or do you buy merch or you know how big is it you know let me know I am curious <laughs> this is nice Go Rush. So this is a different series. Go Rush. Oh well, yeah, actually, English so one way by Psyche Youth K. Okay, these ones have subtitles. The nice. Yeah. <laughs> Was that a robot? The small one. Ascending to Cosmos. Oh, this started completely different than uh, than the others. I'm gonna play this a bit louder. I like his voice, he's like singing so relaxed. I was not expecting that. That face and that body, no, no, no way. I was not expecting that. And most importantly, this is a dog face. This guy is good. Who's this? Cosmos, it doesn't say. His voice is nice. Cosmos is the name of the song, probably. Cool. Cool. I really like this one. This one was nice. Very nice. Hmm. 
Cool. Okay. I think that was it. That was it, guys. Um, if I'm not mistaken. Let's go back a bit. Double check. But I think that's it. Yeah, that's it. 38 out of 38. Thanks very much. It was a long one. Uh, I am a bit tired, guys. You know, that's why I don't look that enthusiastic. Um, it's been a long day and uh, uh, we had to travel to some friends. I, we just came back, sorted out a few things, and now I'm making this video. I said I'm going to pull it up, up, post it on the weekend, but uh, I am filming now on Sunday, but I think it's going to gonna post it tomorrow see how long the uploading and and checking uh, takes me plus the editing you know I gonna try to edit it today and uh, post it tomorrow morning you know uh, so yeah look thanks very much for for asking uh, for recommending and like I said if you have any other recommendations don't hesitate <clears throat> don't hesitate to drop them down in the comment section I would appreciate it uh, like, share, subscribe if you like the content, uh, guys, and I will see you on the next video. Bye.